biting at my feet and stuff. So basically got him settled down. We had dinner. Kept just being a little bit annoying during dinner. But we got him calmed down a little bit. Um, got him outside, of course, before dinner. You know, the first guy to kind of wear him out. And he's definitely the type of dog that wants to be near you. Even if he's outside, he prefers to be you out there also. Like, he'll go outside to go to the bathroom. If you don't follow him, he runs off the patio and runs back and doesn't go to the bathroom. So, kind of a pain in the butt, but it is what it is. So, yeah, we ended up watching um, a couple episodes of Young Sheldon because we could. We had to wait for the dog to get here. And by the time we had dinner, we ended up having two episodes to watch today. So, it's a fun little show. So, not a big deal. So we watched a couple episodes of that. After dinner, went ahead and headed outside, hang out with the dog. It's still hot. It's so gross and hot out there, but it is what it is. So we was able to get it finished up and uh, headed back in. Decided I didn't want a snack tonight. I just don't feel like having a snack. So um, wife was basically willing to watch an episode of Frasier. She watched that and she was setting her alarm. She got to get up early. I'm like, you got to set your alarm for early or actually get up early? Because those are two different things. And she kind of chuckled about that, but it is what it is. So, yeah, went ahead, said to hell with it. Um, pretty much all the day was working on somebody else's plant with no real benefit to me. And just the right thing to do. And a lot of driving and a lot of sweating. So, yeah, that's all I got for now. I will talk to you guys tomorrow. Have yourself a safe, wonderful day. Thanks for watching.